Welcome back to another episode of Arrested Development, your favorite show on YouTube and possibly even on cable television. And today we're gonna to be talking about how to remove rust on your metal parts. That's right, let's get into it. Roll the intro. Now the story of rust and the two guys who talked about it in two minutes. It's Arrested Development. Welcome back. We always put two minutes on the clock before we get rolling, so let's do that. Three, two, one. <clears throat> Metal Rescue Bath, Metal Rescue Gel. Kelvin, take it away. Metal Rescue Bath and Gel are water-based rust removals. Did you say water to remove rust? I did. But normally water causes rust, and these people know that because they, they, they watch the channel. I know, it's crazy. So you're saying that this is water-based and it still removes the rust. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Go on. So these are water-based rust removal products and they come in three formulations. We have Metal Rescue Bath, that it comes in a big jug and is already formulated. Then we have the Metal Rescue Concentrate, which you add a gallon of water to. And then we have Metal Rescue Gel, which is fantastic for vertical surfaces or large, huge metal parts like a car or a heavy piece of machinery. Let's first talk about the Metal Rescue Bath. The bath is perfect for soaking bulk parts, one part, any part that you can soak completely in the bath, it's perfect. But how does it work? Well, it works through chelation. And I know you're saying, Chris, what is chelation? I don't even know how to spell or pronounce that. Well, it took me some time as well. And what it is, is it's Latin for the word claw. And these claws are hungry, baby. They're hungry for rust. And they are going through finding rust, picking the rust off the metal part, and suspending it in the liquid. Which is why this bath starts out looking like water, and towards the end of its use, will look like used motor oil. Now you can use it again and again and again until it gets fully black, but the beauty of this is it's reusable, and it's completely safe to deal with. And just to reiterate, there are no nasty phosphoric acids in either of these products, which is a game changer when it comes to rust removers. We like to say it's safe on everything except rust, and that's, well, because it is. Now switching over to Metal Rescue Gel, it's super easy to use. Let's say you have a vertical surface, all you have to do is lather some of that gel on, put on some cling wrap, literally the stuff that you have in your kitchen drawer, just to keep it from drying out. You'll notice that the gel starts out a little bit yellow, but by the time it is done, it gets kind of black and gross looking. That's just the magic working, ladies and gentlemen. You might be looking at these and you may have noticed, well, why is there a blaster logo on here? I thought you guys were armor. Well, they work it like a pro and we are clean, safe, and easy. And we thought it was a match made in heaven. Now we are probably about out of time by now, and I know the tears are shedding, we're getting a little bit emotional because we'll see you next time. But if you have any questions at all about Metal Rescue, rust remover bath or gel, how to remove rust, or more importantly, how to prevent it in the first place, definitely reach out to us at info at armorvci.com because we are the rust wizards, the eradicators of rust, actually. We have all the answers to your rust questions. It's clean, it's safe, it's easy. It's Metal Rescue, baby. You guys have a great rust-free day.